Hey guys, this is Teddy here, and uh, this is a tutorial video for the MapleStory damage calculator I um, created. And so I will basically uh, teach you the best way to use this device uh, or this tool. And so uh, I would start by uh, entering your information of the character uh, that you'd like to te test the um, calculator on. And so I'm going to do it on my Phantom. Uh, yeah, so you fill in these forms. And I think the first thing, if you're on the login screen that is, you should check is your character cards and how much attack they give. And so I have 5 plus 3 attack, and so I would fill in 8 in the character card um, slot. And uh, yeah, so now I'm going to... You can't see this. Uh, that's my pick. And... Yes. All right. So let's see. I have uh, two mil, two mil range on this character, and so my goal, um, my goal really is to figure out what my range actually is. Because even though it says it's two mil, two mil, it's actually much higher than that. I think. So um, this is the way that this should be done. Um, so you should start off by taking off equips until you go below 2 mil, 2 mil. Uh, I think it's better if you have the max range below 2 mil, 2 mil. So I'm going to take off some of my tyrants. Um, yes, okay, I took off 4 tyrants and now I'm below 2 mil, 2 mil. Good. Uh, and so now, um, the way you do this is you start by looking at your stats. Uh, and uh, you fill in your stats, uh, uh, the ones that your the calculator allows you to fill in. So I can get to fill in Dex and Luck. Exactly how it's written here, the total stat in your stat window. And uh, let's see, the next easiest would probably be Link Skills. So you go to your Link Manager, figure out how much, um, how many, how much you get, basically that affects your damage range. And so, uh, um, I have Elementalism and Wild Rage that gives me 20% damage. I have uh, Core Aura, which gives me a nice 3 attack. And of course, oh, oops. I have um, Blessing at level, well, so uh, I have Blessing at level 20, or 20 attack on both Empress and Fairy. So you fill in 20 here, uh, and uh, that should actually be, the number you fill in there should be the maximum of mm, these two. Uh, and so since mine are both the same, I, I, I can only put 20. And okay, so the next thing I do is going to be by far the hardest part, which is adding up my equipment attack. So I'm going to do this, like, I'm going to show you guys me doing this. So. Uh, let's see, this totem gives me 12, okay, I'm actually going to go here. This totem gives me 12 attack, plus 7, plus 6, let's see, this ring gives me 10 attack. Oh, did I mess up? Okay, let's start over again. <laughs> yeah, 12 plus 7 plus 6. 6 plus 10 plus 3 plus uh, 29 plus 40 plus uh, 10 plus 37 plus. And you should be careful because bonus pot attack is easy to forget here. Uh, plus 14, plus 37, plus 344, plus uh, uh, 47, plus 13, plus 30, plus 
Sorry, I, I probably sound really stupid right now, saying like numbers, just adding things, but I know. <laughs> 34 plus. Probably messed up already too, but we'll see. Let's hope this works out. Plus 11 attack from bonus pot. Plus 21. Plus. Boss emblem. 1. Plus. Uh, 2 plus 12 from bonus pot, plus 3 from metal, and then uh, the heart with 90 attack. Alright, so if I added everything up correctly, I should have 897 attack here. Uh, and why don't I fill that in? 897. Uh, the percent attack, well, uh, uh, okay, so I already messed up, sort of, but I caught it just in time. I forgot to add in set effects. So I have two sets. I have the Superior Golic set, which gives me 35 attack. And then I have uh, um, the Fafnir set, uh, or Root Abyss set, which gives me 50 attack. So that should give me 85 more attack. And so my total attack should actually be 982 as of right now. Um, back to percent attack. Uh, my cane has uh, 39 attack, 39 percent attack. My carte has 39 percent attack, and uh, my boss arena emblem has 24 percent attack. That should add up to uh, 102 percent attack, I believe. And then my Fafnir cane has uh, 9 percent total damage. And that is it. Uh, yes. So I should actually already be ready. Um, to calculate my damage range, uh, but let me just say that uh, buffs also work uh, if you would like to use certain buffs that um, increase your damage range. Um, you would have to fill in them yourself though, because this calculator was sort of created more so for clean range um, testers. And um, right, and this slot here is inner ability attack. My inner ability, I, I don't have any attack there, so I don't have to worry about that. And Will of the Alliance is a beginner skill that I don't have yet, but I plan to get soon. So I, you just take this if you have it. Um, right. So now I am going to calculate, and uh, please wish me luck because I almost never get it right the first time. And boom. So uh, very crazily, amazingly enough, this is actually correct. So one thing about my damage calculator is that uh, sometimes it's off by one if you enter everything correctly. And that's just actually, I'm going to blame this on Nexon because I've tried every permutation of uh, rounding in my formula and nothing works for all jobs. And so this is just one that will always be um, at most one, uh, just one off, like on either max or min or both. And so mm, I did this correctly which is, you know, amazing. But yeah, so uh, I'm gonna also say that uh, there are many things you can mess up on when calculating uh, your attack, and most commonly people forget uh, their totems, uh, the set effects from, yeah, set effects, uh, maybe sometimes they forget pet equips, uh, sometimes they can have attack, and also, um, What's the last thing that people forget? Uh, uh, oh right, that's right. If you uh, if you're a class that uses throwing stars or bullets, you also need to factor those in into your equipment attack. And uh, you might also have noticed that I didn't include any attack uh, from passive skills other than link skills. Uh, that's because my calculator um, should already have them. Um, or well, is supposed to already have them um, already incorporated for each individual class, so you shouldn't have to worry about those, and my calculator assumes that those are all max leveled, um, so yeah. So now why don't I get to the real part, which is um, finding out how much actual range I have when I gear everything up. So the next thing I do, I would add up, you know, I took off four equips, so I add up the attack from all four of these equips. So my cape gives... Um, my K gives 117 plus 21. My gloves give 154. My shoes give 157. Uh, 
Uh, oh, plus 12. Okay, plus 12. And my belt gives 152. Okay, that's a total of 613 attack. And so I'm going to add this to my original 982. And I get an updated attack, which you should fill out. 1595. And next, you just need to equip these. And the only thing you need to do now is you go into your stat window and you update your stats that you originally inputted to the new ones. 4338 uh, and uh, 18506. Nice. And so if you do this, then the calculation um, should be exact. Assuming you didn't mess up, like when you added up everything from those equips that you had originally taken off. Which means that my damage range clean is uh, about mm, 3.9, uh, 4 mil to 4.4 mil. And so, yeah, that should be my clean range. Um, and so, yeah, so this is how, um, this is the best way to use this um, tool that I created. And so, a few other things that I wanted to address. Um, uh, there should be details, uh, if you hover over the, the titles of the columns, uh, you should, uh, yeah, and you should see um, some details about what you include and what you don't include uh, in each box. So, uh, yeah, um, these, yeah. Uh, and uh, let's see, if you have any issues or comments or anything, you can click this thing here and then you can fill out this thing. I just took it off some website online and this will send an email to uh, to my email and I will if you enter your email which it says it is not necessary if you just want to give a comment or something but if you want uh, me to return your email you should um, put your email here uh, yeah and uh, yeah so I guess that's about it. I hope um, that was understandable and that um, you guys um, are able to use this, um, this tool that I created.